Welcome to Memphis Zoo Vision. Today we'll be talking about the six-banded armadillo. We have two six-banded armadillos here at the Memphis Zoo, both inside the Animals of the Night building. This armadillo is named after the flexible bands across its back, which can number between six to eight. When you're covered in an armored shell, it's important to have those bands so that you can move around. Just like turtles and tortoises, the shell is made up of bony plates called scoots and serves to protect them from predators. These inquisitive little creatures are crepuscular, meaning that they are awake during the dawn and dusk hours of the day. Unlike their three-banded cousin, the six-banded armadillo cannot roll itself into a ball. Instead, if it is out foraging for food and encounters a predator, it will take its toenails and dig them into the soil, tuck all of its limbs underneath its shell, and that's how they protect themselves. When not out and about, they'll hide themselves in dens and burrows. Armadillos are true omnivores and will eat just about anything. One of their favorites here at the Memphis Zoo is bugs. All armadillos come from Latin America. There is one species, the nine-banded armadillo, that has been seen in the United States. This six-banded armadillo can weigh anywhere between seven and 14 pounds. They live for up to 15 years in captivity, and you'll find them on the grasslands of South America. You may hear this animal referred to as the yellow armadillo. The word armadillo actually means little armored one. Surprisingly enough, two of the closest relatives to the armadillo are sloths and anteaters. Luckily for the six-banded armadillo, the conservation status is listed as least concern. However, in their native South America, they are hunted for their meat, and there is the threat of displacement due to deforestation. Happily for Bo, there are no dangers in his world, and he seems perfectly content to play around as he sees fit. He even takes time out of his busy schedule to enjoy a back rub. If you're itching to get a first-hand experience with the armadillos, come visit them inside of the Animals of the Night building. This has been a presentation of Memphis Zoo Vision. Thanks for watching.